So we're out at the park Buddy. and we are walking Buddy. and we um, I also wanted to mention that where we live is kind of an um, area where people tend to like just change like you know just throw their clothes down they had their clothes on the ground by uh, Joy John there was a piece of underwear and I found some socks it's kind of weird but that's the place we live in it's called America so uh, America the Great Hopefully that's not human. You never know anymore. So yeah, this is the area. This is where, oh, let's go look at the ice um, sculptures. Okay, so we were here um, maybe about a couple, maybe two months ago or so, um, or a month ago, and uh, they had made, it was uh, some ice sculptures. They actually did, it was Nile, Niles Ice Fights, or Niles Ice Festival of 2014. So these are the ones that won, and even though it's been about a month and a half ago, they still look really good. It, it's super icy out here, I think. This is the one that won with the shield. It's the, oh, that's the, supposed to be the guy out there. I didn't realize that was the guy. Yeah. It looked like it's mane. That's the way it looked like. Pretty cool. This was the the chainsaw one, I think, right? Yeah. Buddy's pretty good though. That's pretty neat. I like the horse one though. Oh yeah. Here you have this. Poop. Hopefully oh, that's not human. Um, I'm sure you have hobos and hillbillies and uh, homeless people. Um, which is sad, you know. I wish it wasn't like that, but that's how the economy is. Anywhere you go. Um, but it is about, what is it, 20 degrees? Or, I don't know. It was like 20 or 20, 29 degrees or something. 25 I think it was degrees and uh, so it's really cold I have kind of a thin coat on but that's kind of how, how's it how it goes you know when you live in a place like this you know you, I don't know you just you get used to it you know and I'm, I'm my ears are really cold I'm kind of numb but it's actually um, really refreshing you know it's cold weather and usually we've been having like arctic uh, chills lately like it was like negative it was like below zero these past several days um for weeks it's been like below you know or you know it's just it's just been really cold here there's a little ice thing right there let me see if i can zoom in on that i don't know if you can kind of make it out it's kind of blurry in it this is nice vlogging i haven't vlogged in like a long time it's nice to talk to you guys even though i'm just talking to a camera you guys want to get a sofa? I hear they come, come nice and ready with uh, different insects and stuff. Different bed bugs, all that good stuff. It's very clean. Um, no, really, actually. The rent centers, I like that. Uh, one time I was back here and I saw a hobo over there, some homeless guy. If it was just me, he'd probably be flirting or something like that. He'd probably do, oh man. You never know people sometimes. Okay. I just want to say hi to my friend Laura. If you're watching this, Laura, look at the view here. When you come visit, you'll be able to, like right now, it it's, looks really cold because it is. My hands are like really red. I mean, look at my hands. They're red. Some I can drum. I'm a drummer. I haven't done that in a long time. I'm actually thinking about getting my drums back. Um, oh, and I also wanted to say thank you. I don't know if you guys ever watch my videos or not, but I'll let you know so you guys can watch this one. But um, 
I wanted to say a special thanks to uh, Shimen and Mike, um, two of my friends. Um, I've known them for a little while. Well, I've known Shimen like all my life, but um, Mike actually plays the uh, guitar and drums, and so I basically he's a musician and he sings. So it's pretty cool because we were thinking about starting a band, but we never just we never had time. Both of us were our busy families and uh, different things, and and they had gotten me a snare drum and with a note on it, and it was very very personal and very nice, and I really liked it. It really made me feel happy, and it, it was encouraging, you know. Because you can get kind of down in the winter. I mean, you can feel kind of depressed. I mean, you know, I, I know I do. I have depression, and, um, you know, so that you do get down you, and stuff. So, and best thing to do when you have depression is just, just keep busy. And, and basically, that's, you know, it's hard to do that, though. But, yeah, so anyway. They had sent me that, and I've already kind of played around with it. Um, it is a really nice Gretsch. It's a really nice uh, snare drum. Really cool, because I can swap that out with the, the one I already have. And, uh, you know, just play around, like, tune one different, like, tone, and then tune the other one a different tone. So, it just looks really, like, cool, though. Majestic is what I like to say. They install these new things everywhere throughout the trail. They're, um, these are chin-up bars, Isaac. What? This is for adults. Oh. It says World Trail Chin-Up. You can do chin-up, inclined chin-up, introverted, oh, that's or in inverted chin-ups. And there's, because I noticed these like all down the, the area, like spread out. There's another one over here. Probably encouraging people to exercise. exercise yeah. Well, this is actually like, um, I know I've seen it in other vlogs. On Venice Beach, they actually, in California, they have, on Venice Beach, they have a, um, what is it called, Muscle Beach. I actually think that'd be awesome to check that out. I don't know if we'll be anywhere near Venice Beach. I don't if know. If we go, where we go in California. It's Santa Ana, where we're going. Yeah, but I mean, like, I didn't know if it would be... So this is another one. It's really like basic. What it vertical climb up and over climb side to leg rise. That's awesome. Climbing a wall. It's not that high, but still. So you kind of have to use your imagination on some of these things. That's kind of cool. I I want to use it. I want to try it. It's gonna be a little bit embarrassing. You know, I hear like when you work at Muscle Beach in California, people are watching you or, you know, I don't know, it's just kind of different, but I mean, you know. Okay, so, so this is a jump and touch. Different. Looks kind of hard. Looks like a lot of work. Oh, and they have they have volleyball. It's set up like beach volleyball. There's sand, and uh, yeah, two nets, and they're nice. And they got some grills here, so you can grill. Right now, it just looks like a desert with snow. But yeah, this place is actually pretty pretty hippin'. It's pretty hippy hop, hippy hop, hop and hop, hip. I don't know. So anyway, well, I got a couple of big events coming up. Yeah. What's that? Inclined body cup. Oh, neat. Okay. Um, so, what I was going to say was that um, actually my cousin, I got some big events coming up. My cousin's getting married. Um, and she asked me to be her maid of honor, which I'm really thrilled about being. It's actually really fun. Um, it's been a little bit slow right now, but I think it's starting to pick up. Like there's some things going on right now that's kind of like picking up a little bit more. You know, as a, as a, as far as being a maid of honor and stuff like that. So it's exciting. I'm a little nervous. Um, I'm sure she is and everyone else involved. But you know, that's what you're supposed to be nervous. So, but I'm excited. I'm really excited. I got my dress. It looks awesome. And I got my shoes. 
they look awesome and very sparkly. Um, I just gave you guys a hint of, if you don't know, what Jess is going to look like. But yeah, I'm going to video, I'm going to vlog that too. I mean, not the wedding, but I might, I might do a little bit of, probably the after party. I'm probably going to, I like how I said after party. I mean the, um, what's that called? The, the after party? Um, it's called. I don't, I don't really know. Uh, no, for a wedding. For, 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 uh, reception. Reception. Yeah. Wow, oh, it's cold here. Going against this cold. Yeah. But anyway, for the reception, I'm probably gonna videotape it, put it on YouTube. You can see it on the trail, but. So, so uh, I'm sounding funny because I'm really cold. When you walk this way, it's a lot worse because it's windy, so the wind is actually more harsh, and it's like cold air. There's poop. He just peed almost on my foot. <laughs> he almost peed on my foot. So I thought I'd be very mature like that and show you guys some dog turd. But you never know, it could be human. You know, I found human turd before. Uh, and no, it wasn't my own. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't my own turd, I promise you. I mean, I've looked at my own for like at least five minutes sometimes. You know, gathering the information of how possibly it could look like that after you ate a whole meal. You know, but um, it's kind of amazing. Yeah, anyone that knows me knows that I do not embarrass easily, but when I do, I get very embarrassed. Yes. A few things embarrass me in this world, in my life. But I, don't, I probably end up offending half the people that know me. But um, I mean, not like, you know, in a bad way, but they're probably just kind of disgusted a little bit and probably think, you know, wow, she's like a 13-year-old or something. I'm actually 23, by the way, you know, so, you know. But, uh, you know, you, you gotta have that kid inside of you, you know. Kids just want to come out, come free. This camera's very cold to hold, by the way. It's metal or some aluminum. It's aluminum steel. So my hands are like freaking red. Look at that. Oh, I got a new ring. We went out to eat at a breakfast place. It was awesome. But I got this ring for 25 cents. It's the most I've ever spent on a ring in my life. Well, actually, no, I've, I have some other, I have some other rings, but this was given to me by grandma. Oh man, my hands are red. They hurt. And then this one I bought for like 10 or 15 bucks. Oh my gosh. My, hands you guys this is terrible I want to be in California right now I mean I watch other people's vlogs because that's what I do since I'm a vlogger I participate anyway when I was watching the people in California it's like 60 degrees and they're like freezing that's not cold I mean to you guys but that's not cold that is beach weather for me here I can't wait until we go to California though Lots of reasons. Lots of reasons, right, Isaac? Uh -huh. Yeah. So anyway, um, I just wanted to say hi to everybody, but it turned out to be more than just a hi. It was very intimate on a very intimate, intimate level, because I'm very, I'm very much like that. Um, so that's, there's some ice, there's some ice. I, I just felt like vlogging since I'm outside. It's easy to vlog outside the lighting and everything. It's, it's more to see and do, but when I'm inside, it's just kind of, I don't know, I just... When I walk and talk, I have things to say, but when I am sitting in the house, I don't know what to talk about at the planet. Uh, oh, that's what I have to do when I want to make videos. I do have to plan what I'm going to do. So, I'm going to have a lot of editing, because I'm just like blabbing my face off, so my lips are just... Big flappers. I feel like when I talk so much, I have so much saliva in my mouth that I could drown a child. Wait, that sounded weird. <laughs> uh, uh, it's so like bone chilling. I cannot even feel my hands. I probably am getting frostbite. Like, I'm not kidding. Are you? I'm getting I feel like I've gotten frostbite. Look at my hands, they're all swollen. 
Well, maybe you should just put them in your pocket. They're swollen. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go. It's cold. Okay, I'm gonna vlog more.